In today's video, I am going to be making a basketball court for you guys, and this is going to be like a park basketball court type of thing. One of you guys commented on one of my videos that I cannot find, but they wanted me to make a basketball court with the new basketball items. So that's what we're going to be doing in today's video. So because this is a park basketball court, I do want to give it more of like a beat down type of vibe to where it's not like super clean. So I want to have like overgrown grass and stuff like that. So I think that'd be really cool. But for now, let's get our of course basketball court which is huge like look at this thing it's huge I feel like it's a little too big in my opinion but we have it and that's what we got to work with so here we go and then the first thing I'm going to do is something that people were wondering is how to fill in this rectangle right here because it doesn't match up with the grid itself so the best way to do this and I know some people are not able to do this but it is one of the best ways is to use a cube and resize it so I'm gonna do it like this and then I'm just gonna set another one here and then another one here and then resize this one there we go so we we have our little court and then I'm gonna set this over here as well just duplicate it so you can either leave it like this if you don't have the transform plus tool but if you do have the tool which I did make a video about recently you're gonna want to bring it into the ground just a little bit so where it matches up with the flooring so that is how you get the color on the outside and then for the extra color which we don't have to put but if you wanted to then you would just use your flooring like normal I don't want that because we are doing just a park court type of thing so here we go oh no I can't pick up the flooring bruh what okay I have to like completely haha <laughs> I gotta go into the basement okay well that's just lovely so we're gonna actually just place a piece of flooring and we're gonna change the color of it out here that's very inconvenient not gonna lie all right now we'll add our flooring just like this all right so of course now we need our basketball hoops and because this is an actual court I am going to be using the basic basketball hoop next I'm going to get the long metal benches and I'm just gonna place them around they don't have to be exact but you just you want some some benches out here because obviously we got people playing basketball and they're gonna need some spots for their water bottles and their bags and speaking of bags we're going to be using the gym duffel bag because it adds more to the build itself so I'm gonna place one here I'm gonna place one on the ground I'll place one over here as well I'll do this one on the ground I'm also gonna add these slippers that we have to make it look like they're slides because a lot of sports people have slides before they put on their shoes themselves so I'm gonna turn those black just like that and then I'm also gonna add some over here I'm also gonna place the water jug because there could be in a role play scenario if you are role playing there could be a water jug for people who are like staying all day so we could have one of those and then I'm gonna hop out of build mode and I'm actually gonna get some of the water bottles out and then place some of them around here looking good and then I'll set one more right next to it and you know some people they might use a bike to get there and some might use a car so that means we're gonna need some keys so I'm gonna place some keys here to make it look like they are someone who does drive a car and and then I'm also gonna place a bike over here. Um, hopefully the cheap one, 3,500, not super cheap, but it's fine. And I'm just gonna place this bike like it's leaning against the bench to make it look like that is how they got here. Some courts, they do have fencing. So what I do wanna do is add some fencing on the sides. I'm gonna use the tall, simple metal fence and I'm just gonna place it like this to hopefully like block basketballs that are going around. Oh my gosh, I forgot basketballs. Um, that's pretty important. I cannot believe I actually forgot that. That's hilarious. We'll place one like right here and then maybe another one here because they all have their own. So now I'm gonna add some overgrown grass. So let's do this and then I'm gonna change it to the grime color with the grass texture. Perfect. And I'm just gonna place a few of those around to make it look like the park needs some maintenance, you know, make it realistic. We're gonna add some shorter ones. Honestly, the grass like really helps the build. I'm surprised. Gotta have some trees. I love this tree because I can change the texture. All right, here's my tree. Just gonna do this type of thing because they're in a park so obviously we gotta have some trees around here landscaping is supposed to look natural but also not forced bruh it really had to switch up the colors on me like that that's so mean so you don't want it to look forced so you have to just place stuff randomly until it looks real in a way so here is that courts can also have lighting um attached to the basketball hoop itself so i'm going to use the street light and i'm gonna add that here like so okay so now i'm gonna change the color of the cubes oh my gosh i cannot dude i i can't pick up the okay we're gonna move this for a second because oh my gosh it's attached to it I did not know that was possible. Wow, I look like a serious Bloxburg pro right now having all these issues. 
Aha, yes, okay, this is what I wanted. So concrete, and then I'm gonna change it just to make it a little bit lighter. I'm going to attempt to color the other spots if I can. Aha, okay, okay, there's one. Wow, you really gotta zoom in for these. If you don't have basement, don't do this because it's truly a struggle. Okay, there we go. So we got our light colors going on here. And then what else? I wanna add a little bit more because it's still feeling a little plain. Oh, I should probably change the color of the bags. Yeah, someone wants a black duffel bag. Let's do like a, a blue one. A white water bottle there we go and then this one can be like a reddish kind of color Ooh, that's nice and then a gray water bottle i'm gonna add some of these plants just to add more color i think i'm also gonna add the path that we have which like nobody uses i'm gonna make it look like it's kind of part of the build in a way to make it look a little realistic because we're making a park so like there we go we have a little path to it how cute and then maybe the path can like go off in a different direction cool actually i like that a lot Cause look at this, like that's a good shot right here. The lights are a little harsh, so I am gonna bring down the lighting just a little bit. And I think I'm gonna do the oyster color. That seems to actually look really nice. So we're gonna do the oyster. And that, my friends, is your basketball court. Honestly, it's pretty cute. I like it. It turned out a lot better than I thought it would. And the total of this build is not a number I thought it would be, but it's gonna be 43,400. I'm gonna do a trick shot. I'm gonna do it backwards. Watch this. I've got skills. Oh no! You didn't see that. You didn't see that. Ready? Okay, I got skills. Bro, why are you doing this to me? No, this has literally never happened before. Hang on. I got skills. There we go. See? First try. Anyways, that is it for the little build tutorial, I guess you could say. This was a lot of fun to make. If you have not yet subscribed, make sure you do, and I will see you guys next time.